Well, greetings viewers and voyeurs, got that funk here in a video response to the atheist antidote in his recent video, Atheism is Devoid of Liberty. No God equals no liberty. Brock, I couldn't really uh, disagree with you more vehemently. I personally feel that um, rights don't come from any exterior source, not from God and not from the government. It's my most cherished personal belief that rights come from me. I am the sovereign of my own body. And therefore, if you follow that basic premise through to its logical conclusions, that means that I'm in charge of what I say, freedom of speech. I'm in charge of what I do. I'm in charge of where I go. So freedom of movement, freedom of association, uh, freedom of belief. All of those things naturally emanate from the premise that I'm in charge of me. I'm in charge of my own body. That the people, individuals, proclaim their rights. They are not granted. They're proclaimed. It's a fundamental and very important difference. And for proof, Brock, for evidence that I'm right, I point you to the Constitution of the United States. Very first words of which are, We the people. We the people do ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States. We the people. Not God. Not on behalf of God. Not in the name of Jesus Christ. We the people do ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States. It's as simple as that. I found your video to be insulting and disingenuous. I, I find that uh, you, you, you think you're so fucking clever by issuing some sort of challenge as if there's no way that rights could come from anywhere if not from God. But rights are a human construct, man. They don't actually exist. We proclaim them. We assume them because we want them. That's where they come from. The individual's desire to speak as they want, to do as they want, to love who they want. All of those things are part of liberty, and all of those things can be taken away by an oppressive government, but they're not given to us by a less oppressive government. A less oppressive government simply allows us to be free enough to exercise our liberty. So yeah, governments can repress your liberty, but they don't give it to you. The best a government can do is protect your liberty. That's the best they can do. Anyway, chew on that. Let me know what you think. This is Got That Funk. Thanks for watching, and may all your ups and downs be ups.